Selin Kesanja Lalkin. I am studying Bachelor of Music Education in UPSI. Right now, I'm in my third semester and taking Advanced Piano Proficiency as one of my music subjects. This week's form topic is about harmonizing. The question given is, select any four bars as an example from the lead sheet score House of the Rising Sun and demonstrate what position of left hand chords from the lead sheet given that you use to harmonize the right hand melody so right now let's go to the piano keyboard so this is the piece of house of the rising sun the first thing you need to detect is the time signature and the key signature the time signature for this piece is 3 4 and the key signature is f major because there's only one flat which is the b flat so on the first bar, you can see that there's a D crochet on treble clef and a crochet press on the bass clef. So we're going to go on the piano and set our hands pressing the D. So on second bar, you can see that the chord for the second bar is D minor. So in D minor, you can use the D, F, and A even though it says only to play the D and F so we're going to play on the right hand D and on the left hand D F A on the second note is E so on bar 3 we are going to play on the right hand C and F so the chord progression for bar 3 on the left hand is F, which is the F, A, and C. But it's too far away from the C, so we're going to use the lower C, C, F, A. So we're going to play on the second note, A. On bar 4, we're going to play on the right hand the D and the G on the left hand we're going to play the chord progression of G major which is the G B and D but we can use the lower D G and B to the next note is also D on bar 5 on the right hand we're going to play the B flat and the D. So on the left hand, we're going to harmonize it with the B flat chord progression B flat, D, and F. Even though it says we're only going to play the B flat and F, but we're going to make it fuller sound, so we're going to play with the B flat, D, and F. It sounds like this. Going to the next note is the D. Next, I'm going to play the whole song and I'm going to play it with the metronome. We're going to try on the slower tempo, which is the 60 beat per minute. 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, I'm going to play a little bit faster than the other one which is the 80 beat per minute and I'm going to play the whole thing one two three one two to an end of my discussion about harmonizing melody so if you want to harmonize a melody you can use the chord progression if it stops on D you can use the lower D which is the D minor or the D major you can also use the C and lower C which is the C major or C minor so that's all from me Thank you for your attention. See you again.